everybody, my name is Vinay Jacob John. Please visit my two websites, jesushealsministries.org and also prayingtongues.org. Today we are going to read about marriage in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let us turn to the book of Isaiah. Isaiah is in the Old Testament of the Holy Bible. Isaiah 54, verse 5. For our Maker, Jesus, is our husband, the Lord of hosts, Jehovah is your name, and our Redeemer, the Holy One of Israel, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The Lord God, Jehovah of the whole earth, shall you be called Jesus. Verse 6. For the Lord God, Jehovah, has called thee as a woman forsaken and grieved in spirit, and a wife of youth, when thou wast refused, says thy Lord God, Jehovah. Verse 7. For a small moment have I forsaken thee, but with great mercies will I gather thee. Verse 8. In a little wrath I hid my face from thee for a moment, but with everlasting kindness will I have mercy on thee, says the Lord God, our Redeemer, Jehovah, Jesus, Holy Spirit. This, this passage is talking about Jesus on the cross. Jesus took our sins and Jesus' own body on the tree that we being dead to sin should live unto righteousness by Jesus Christ of Nazareth's stripes we were healed and also Jesus took our spiritual death away in our inner man down in hell for three days and three nights but after the third day the Lord God Jehovah raised Jesus from hell by the power and love of the Holy Spirit inside Jesus so let's turn to the book of Jeremiah chapter 33 Jeremiah is in the Old Testament of the Holy Bible. Jeremiah 33, verse 11. The voice of joy and the voice of gladness, the voice of the bridegroom Jesus, and the voice of the bride Jesus' church, Jesus' body. We are Jesus' bride. Everybody here on this planet Earth, and everybody in heaven above, and everybody who was in hell below. Jesus shall not lose one. The voice of them that shall say, Praise the Lord God Jehovah of hosts, for the Lord God Jehovah is good, for your mercy Lord God Jehovah endures forever. And of them that shall bring the sacrifice of praise into the house of our Lord God Jehovah. Also let's turn to the book of Malachi. Malachi is in the Old Testament of the Holy Bible. Malachi chapter 2 verse 14. Because the Lord God Jehovah has been witness between you and the wife of your youth, against whom thou hast dealt treacherously, yet she is your companion and the wife of your covenant. Verse 15. And did not Jesus make one, yet had Jesus the residue of the Spirit? And why one? That Jesus might seek a godly seed. Therefore take heed to your spirit, and let none deal treacherously against the wife of his youth. Verse 16, For the Lord, the God of Israel, Jehovah, says that Jehovah hates putting away our divorce. For one covereth violence with his garment, say the Lord of hosts, Jehovah. Therefore take heed to your spirit that you deal not treacherously with the wife of your covenant. Also Ephesians in the New Testament of the Holy Bible, Ephesians chapter 5, verse 25. Husbands, love your wives even as Christ Jesus of Nazareth also loves the church. And you, Jesus, you gave yourself for us all, Jesus. Verse 26, that you, Jesus, may sanctify and cleanse us with the washing of water by the word. Jesus is called the word of God in the book of John chapter 1. In the beginning was the word Jesus, and the word was God Jesus, and the word Jesus was with God Jehovah. Holy Spirit. Verse 26, that Jesus might sanctify and cleanse us with the washing of water by the word Jesus is the word. Verse 27, that Jesus might present us all to Jesus himself, a glorious church, not having spot or wrinkle or any such thing, but that we should be holy and without sin, transgression and iniquity without blemish. Verse 30, For we are members of your body, Jesus, we are members of your flesh, Jesus, and we are members of your bones, Jesus. 
verse 31 for this cause shall a man leave his father and mother and shall be joined up to his wife and they too shall be one flesh verse 32 this is a great mystery but I speak concerning Christ Jesus of Nazareth and Jesus his church we are Jesus his church we are Jesus his body here in this banner and also in the book of Ephesians chapter 1 verse 3 Jesus our Lord God Jehovah Jireh our provider has blessed us all with every spiritual blessing in heaven in Christ Jesus. So in Christ Jesus we have every spiritual blessing and for anything we need we can just ask Jehovah in the name of Jesus and it will be provided by the Holy Spirit living in us all here in this planet earth. Also, Hebrews chapter 13, verse 4. Marriage is honorable in all people, and the bed undefiled, or the bed kept pure. But homeowners and adulterers, God will judge. Thank you everybody for listening to me today. Please visit my friend's website, Jesse Duplantis Ministries. Jesse Duplantis is the evangelist. Jesse Duplantis Ministries, www.jdm.org and also Christians United for Israel, www.cufi.org Also please visit my spiritual father's website. My spiritual father's name is Pastor Michael Paul Burgess and he's the pastor of the Church Grace Chapel here in Bangalore City, Karnataka, India www.gracechapel g-r-a-c-e-c-h-a-p-e-l dot o-r-g dot i-n Also please visit my own two websites jesusheelsministries dot o-r-g and also prayingtongues dot o-r-g Jesus loves us all, Jesus heals us all, Jesus provides for us all always in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen.